I've never actually watched that intro video that's just a slow pan and wobbly letters descending. What a thing. What a world. Um, what a Sunday. Hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Paul. <laughs> um, uh, I am an improviser with Repertory Theater and a, and a comedy writer. Um, I don't know if anyone's out there, uh, but this is called Let's Write a Sketch, which is a show where uh, I'm going to write a sketch live uh, based on and including any audience input from any audience that might actually be there. I recognize as we were doing in our chatting before the show um, with Matt, who's running the tech side of it. It's like, ah, it's May long weekend. <laughs> doing a, a fun Sunday afternoon sketch writing thing in the summer was or in the winter was great because it was cold and no one was outside. But not only is it beautiful out, but it's a long weekend. So who knows? But I'm going to write a thing. And if you're there and listening and you want to contribute, I will uh, ask for stuff in the chat. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, and use that as the inspiration to write a sketch. Um, so, you know, there's a 30 second delay between, uh, between me saying something and you hearing it. Uh, so, uh, so I will be already filling plenty of time um, with, with, a, with a wordy ramble. Um, but if you do have a suggestion, uh, we'd love to get started with something with just like a topic you've been thinking about. Uh, otherwise, I'll throw to Matt, uh, <laughs> who can uh, just, uh, just say what he's been thinking about. And I will start, uh, start riffing out an idea based on that. Um, so, people of the internet, of two people watching, uh, see see what you got. Um, if you have anything, or Matt, um, I can hear you. I don't think anyone else can, although if you want to, great. Uh, they can't hear you, but if you want to pitch something. Um, and if anyone thinks I'm lying and just writing about what I want to and there is no Matt, I, I am not. And it would be weirder. I would just say I would start with a topic. Uh, so what you got, Matt? What are what are some topics, a la a birthday party, things that aren't pandemic related that you've been thinking about lately? Matt's thinking, ooh, spring cleaning. Oh, I love it because uh, pertinent um, as the real Paul heads in the crowd will know, uh, we did a big a big garage clean out yesterday um, of our house, which is uh, I live with someone who produces theater for a living, and so it has been uh, just filled. Uh, oh, weird. You can see me seeing me. Um, I'm going to get that out of there real quick. Uh, what a world. Um, yeah. So, uh, uh, yeah. So we did a, my, my roommate uh, just did a big, a big clean of our garage, which has been filled with stuff for literally years. And so, so spring cleaning is going to be the title of this. Uh, we're just going to dive right in. Um, spring cleaning. I like, you know, you dig through stuff uh, written by us. Uh, based on, if any, uh, yesterday at my house. Uh, address and phone number, you do not need to know. Um, okay, close that title page, get to it. Uh, so yeah, I like uh, spring cleaning. Uh, I like the idea of discovering something that you'd forgotten about. There were definitely some odd things that came out of our garage. Um, and so it is in interior uh, uh, old attic. Um, day, um, uh, daylight floods through the few. Uh, the fun thing about this screenwriting software is there is not spell check, if I'm not mistaken, or certainly not autocorrect. So all, all mistakes will be live and, uh, and real. Uh, daylight floods through the window, the one window of the A-frame attic. Um, uh, the, uh, a, uh, uh, floor, floor door. I don't know what those are called. Uh, you know what I mean? Uh, like a hatch. Yeah. The hatch thing. Yeah. <laughs> a floor door, uh, open and, uh, and Dugan and may, uh, poke, puke, uh, poke their heads up into the attic. Um, Dugan is short. Uh, May is tall. This is their dynamic. Uh, great. Um, so they're they're coming up for a spring clean. Um, you know, <laughs> what's uh, what's something you might want? What's a reason you might want to clean your house? I know that's that's quite um, open open to the world. But if you had a reason you wanted to clean a house, what would it be? Um, uh, you know, to get rid of stuff. You know, generally spring cleaning is just like, it feels right to sort of uh, move on from stuff. 
uh, moving on maybe is a good way. Uh, maybe maybe they're moving out of this place, and this is the this is the attic they've never tackled. Um, not since the incident, uh, which we'll find out about later. Uh, 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 May sneezes. Uh, let's make that an action line. May sneezes. Um, we haven't uh, we haven't been up here in ages. Uh, May sneezes. Um, we sure haven't. Uh, May stares at Dugan, who did not say Gesundheit or God bless or whatever. I can't spell Gesundheit. Um, so I'm going to God bless uh, after they sneezed. Um, Dugan doesn't get it. Uh, uh, there must be, uh, there must be the boxes from decades ago. Uh, May, uh, May keeps staring, <laughs> waiting for that sneeze um, to be acknowledged. Oh my God, uh, <laughs> I, I wish Matt. Uh, I wish they. I had written beatboxes from ages ago. Um, Dugan says, uh, uh, "The family home finally sold, finally sold." Um, but we gotta, we gotta dig through them today. The family home finally sold. Um, uh, Dugan finally realizes, notices May's silence. What's up? Uh, May uh, says, uh, uh, I'm going to look up the spelling of Gesundheit really quick. Zhun. I feel like if I type it, Gesundheit, wow, is that really it? Oh, there's, oh, wow, okay, great. Yeah, that'll do. Um, that's the one I'll go with. That looks the most official. Although I like I clicked showing results for one and it brought me to another option um, because that's the way the internet rolls. Uh, what's up? It says Dugan, um, Gesundheit. Um, Dugan says, Thanks. Um, it's dusty up here. Oh, Dugan, you just don't get it. Um, uh, finally home, finally sold. What's up? Zoom tight. It's dusty up here. Great. May says, well, make yourself. Uh, my allergies are going to be so really acting up here. Can you start pulling, pulling out boxes? Uh, Dugan says, you bet. Uh, Dugan uh, pulls a box, uh, steps into the attic and pulls a box. Um, what sort of like, uh, what sort of heirlooms, like what are things that this family was all about? Like, we're not going to say necessarily a dynasty, but like, uh, this family has some stuff they are, they are, if not famous, like locally famous for um, that, like, you know, uh, all the all the old folks who gather at the A&W to drink coffee, talk about the good old days and they talk about the uh, this family's um, uh, the thing they did, the, re the really good thing they did for this town. Um, uh, it's just you. <laughs> uh Ah, uh, yeah, or that there might be mementos of uh, might be another way of thinking about it. Just like what's a what's the sort of world this family is playing in the Dugan and May family? Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Um, they open it. They open it. Whoa, check it out. Um, Dugan reveals. Uh, I should capitalize that reveals a uh, cuckoo and antique cuckoo uh oh wow 
Oh, that's another. Oh boy, that's going to be another another quick trip to Google. Uh, cuckoo clock. Um, oh, what a world! I'm learning a lot today about spelling. Uh, mostly about spelling. Uh, oh no, <laughs> the copy and paste. Uh, okay, it's a typo, but I'm gonna I'm gonna roll with it a bit. Um, cuckoo clock. Um, uh, Dugan sneezes at the sheer volume of dust. Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. Uh, May says Kazuntite because May gets it. Um, no, it's not an action line. Thank you. Uh, oh, I see, because I copied it from an action line. Oh, no, that means I have to spell it again. Uh, no, or steal it from here. Uh, tight. Do again. Thanks. Look, one of uh, grandma's old clocks. She used to, she used, this used to be, used to be the town's main import, export. Um, uh, this was a this was a town driven by uh, uh, she ran the old factory, just pumping these out for years. Dugan remembers, of course, that yeah, but then the great uh, time recession happened, uh, and uh, the factory had to shut down. Nobody was buying time anymore. Everyone was living in the moment. Um, a moment of uh, both let a moment of silence pass. Um, oh, what a time. What a time uh, this shall be. Um, we'll let a moment of silence pass. Uh, like, a, like a solemn moment of silence pass. Um, uh, uh, Dugan, wait, there's something under the clocks. Uh, uh, Dugan drops the clock, it shatters um, uh, because it was porcelain? Question mark? Porcelain? Clocks. I hope that's how you spell Parkland. Yeah, great. What a time. What a time. Uh, <laughs> uh, Dugan. Uh, look. Um, Dugan pulls out a letter. Um, a dusty old letter. We hear an ominous sneeze. <laughs> Otherworldly. Otherworldly, uh, Dugan, Dugan blows the dust off. And we hear another coming from everywhere at once. Um, uh, Dugan says, Gesundheit, copy and paste, my old friend. Um, if I had just learned to spell it, I wouldn't have to do that, but here we are. Um, she's coming from everywhere at once. Um, uh, they look around and see nobody else. Um, Dugan looks back at the letter. Um, oh, there's a baby crying outside. Oh no. <laughs> uh, what have I wrought? Um, Dugan looks back on the letter. Um, wait, is that? Uh, May comes over. Uh, May. It's addressed to us um, because this is going to get real time loop fucky real quick because we dropped a clock and we broke time uh, and <laughs> we're going to see how this how this happens. Um, Dugan hands the uh, May uh, Dugan opens the letter and May starts to read May. Uh, reading. Uh, there we go. Um, dear Dugan and May, please 
if you, I hope this gets, yeah. Oh, great. Hi, Ben. Uh, <laughs> classic Dugan. Definitely classic Dugan. Um, I can only hope you've opened this letter before dropping the clock. Um, for I am you, one of you, which one I won't say. Uh, 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 writing from the past, which is also the future. Uh, Dugan is going to acknowledge that that's a bit weird. Um, you're right, Ben. That's a long bit of text for someone to read. Um, we need to break this up. Uh, uh, great. Uh, Dugan. Um, wait, what? Uh, May says, it's time logic, dummy. Uh, uh, dummy. Uh, Dugan. Let me see that. Uh, Dugan. Dugan grabs. Scraps uh, the letter. Uh, um, Dugan's turn to read because um, someone's got to read it. Uh, parenthetical dialogue. Great. Um, I uh, I dropped when you if you did drop the clock. Listen carefully. You don't have much time because you broke it time you broke time when you dropped that porcelain uh clock may uh may grabs may uh may yeah may grabs may's gonna pick up the some of the shards may uh grabs some of of the shards of the clock, of the clock. Um, something is dripping, <laughs> dripping out, uh, dropping out, uh-oh. Uh, yeah, Ben, I really wanted to up my game after just sharing a Google document last uh, last time we did this. Uh, and this, this was the way to go. <laughs> um, invoice to rapid fire, just kidding. They certainly did not pay for that. Um, out of it. Um, you look at this. Uh, this is going to get to that part where you're like, oh, this is unstageable, but that's fine. Uh, May holds up their hand um, everywhere. The goo, uh, the dripping goo has touched uh, their hand. It is aging, and also parts of it are getting younger <laughs> uh may weird i feel weird um i didn't mean to make it capitals but that seems fair um dugan uh dugan's got to have a catchphrase of some kind got to have like a like a jinkies or a zoinks um what's a sound that uh that a person might make uh yeah, yeah, I'll type it in so it gets to uh, gets to them faster. Um, what's a catchphrase? Uh, made up catchphrase. Uh, just to think on that, because uh, Dugan's gonna say it right now, and maybe I'll layer it in earlier, um, because that's a that's a fun that's a fun bit. Anyway, while we're waiting for that, um, Dugan's gonna keep reading. Uh, catch race for now. Um, and then we're going to keep reading. Um, if any of the liquid time drips onto you, you that part will be forever altered. Um, shifting through ages like sand through an hourglass that just keeps flipping over and over young and old young to old old to young um real weird stuff um may uh says uh yikes and drops uh may drops it's the part of the clock may has picked up 
is picked up. Um, um, it shatters again. Um, TikTok, baby. That's the one, Ben. Um, and pertinent. Thank you for this gift. Uh, where did I write catchphrase? Great. Um, TikTok, baby. Um, if any of this liquid time drips onto you, um, it... Uh, no, I like, I like TikTok baby. That's the way the goo drips baby is a little, is a little weirder, uh, which isn't necessarily bad, but, uh, but there's something <laughs> visceral about TikTok baby that lands for me. Um, great. Uh, okay. Um, this letter's got to get to the point because we were skipping around. Uh, maybe I won't drop this clock yet. Um, uh, okay. Okay. Whatever. Fine. Fine. Um, I'll just copy and paste that out of here. That will be my solution. Um, your hand. Um, yes. Uh, we can just acknowledge that. Um, what do we do? Um, may keep reading. Uh, Dugan. Uh, ch -ch -ch keeps reading. Uh, um, so we left off, where this letter left off was that uh, you broke time when you dropped the porcelain clock. You don't have much of it. Uh, you must, must undo what you've done. Um, one of you must uh, pour all the time do on yourself to hopefully go back in time and prevent us from doing this. Um, the other one must write this letter uh, and uh, stash it, it back in the box to be found. Try to put it on top of the clock so you don't miss out um may i feel weird um dugan tick tock baby uh um uh we gotta um otherwise you may never escape this time loop you've created for yourself um, but also why should we, should we believe this weird old letter? Uh, what if grandma was just the surrealist? Uh, a classic and common question to ask of your family relations. Um, uh, yeah, great. Uh, true. A classic classic and um, common question to ask of one's family. Uh, Dugan reading. I realize you may have doubts about um, this letter as we did, as I did. Um, <laughs> uh, oh, I had a thing. I had a thing. Uh, look, Look, they're reading the letter. It's and it's giving them context, so it's got to be, it's got to be monological, um, if you will. Um, open, open the box beside this one. Uh, May uh, opens the next box. Um, inside is uh, is two weirdly writhing versions of themselves um oh my god um dugan what uh what the frig um boxed uh them speaking in uh speaking in one voice we tried and failed we tried and failed <laughs> um Every box is the same. May, you mean uh, Dugan, 
Yes. Uh, box them. Yes. Uh, uh, so you are the latest in a line of um, time looping, looping uh, versions of yourselves. Um, yeah, this got, this really went a place. Um, really, sometimes, you know, the ending's in the beginning. Let's take a quick, a quick scan back and see what we find. Family home finally sold. Uh, there was a sneeze. Oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. You're right. Um, uh, if you've broken, broken the lamp, there's no escape. Uh, May or Ardugan or is there uh, May? What May? Uh, who is uh, ch -ch -ch. May is now getting older and younger. Uh, is oscillating between older and younger. Um, is there, um, or do you just not want to write the letter? Um, this looks like your handwriting. Dugan, uh, no, I've got a plan. Tick-tock, baby. Uh, um, Dugan, uh, Dugan blows uh, more dust into, in May's direction. May sneezes. Uh, May sneezes. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. Where are you, Gazintite? Where are you, my friend? It's been too long. I require this. This is also, I'm just going to say long for what it is uh, <laughs> at this point. It'll definitely need a pare down. Um, great. But uh, we're almost at the end there. Uh, May sneezes. Because uh, um, tight. Uh, May sneezes, uh, and the time goo flies out of her nose, uh, out of their nose. Uh, uh, the time goo um, wriggles in a puddle on the floor. Like, do you, uh, you're both old enough to know, to possibly remember the YTV show, The Secret World of Alex Mack, where it was like a teenager who kept getting turned into like goo. And it was like an excuse to use an, an early 3D effect to see like goo moving through a screen. Anyway, uh, it's going to move like that. <laughs> I'm goo. Chromie, um, a la the secret world of Alex Mack, um, wriggles and yeah, 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 yeah. Um, like uh, Deep Space Nine too. Um, uh, May slams uh, another uh, grabs. May grabs a. Uh, there's a jar. It's an old. It's an old attic. There's got to be a weird jar up there. Um, a weird jar, and slams it. It over the time goo. Um, uh, May says, got it. Um, Dugan says, uh, oh, with a CK. Thank you, Ben. Um, but did you know that or did you Google that? Uh, <laughs> these are the questions only real 90s teens know. Um, nice. Um, they hate, right, because there's, uh, box them. You did it. Um, Every other box opens um, and more weird, really time affected versions of May and Dugan and uh, come out and start applauding. Um, uh, May and uh, our main uh, sting place over the freeze frame. Um, uh, we see uh, in a Chiron, 
uh, executive <laughs> uh executive producer christopher nolan he loves time stuff uh uh and that <laughs> i'm gonna call that one there um end of sketch really went uh really went somewhere uh i'm not gonna say it's good but i am gonna say i wrote it uh, and that sometimes that's enough you know <laughs> sometimes that gets you where you need to go um thank you um for everyone who tuned in uh ooh, we had someone join right near the end um maybe i'll post this somewhere <laughs> maybe i'll find a place where these can live we have another one from the last time we did this about birthday parties that i've yet to post um and i should uh anyway i also might do an editorial pass and see if it can actually be redeemed and potentially used um uh, all of which to say thank you for tuning in to this may long weekend version of let's write a sketch my name is paul uh this was produced by rapid fire theater uh on treaty six territory um we have uh one more show on our docket uh on june 3rd um we have the uh the nose bowl all-stars uh, which is uh, back in February, we ran, a, we ran a high school festival and uh, picked some some uh, all stars out of that and put, made them into an ensemble. And they're working with our artistic director, Matt Sherman, uh, and uh, and doing a cool show. Check it out um, uh, on your June 3rd. Uh, there'll be tickets on the Rapid Fire Theater website because you need tickets, unlike this, which was free. Um, so once again, thank you for tuning in. Uh, my name is Paul. This has been Let's Write a Sketch. Have yourself a great Sunday afternoon. Bye-bye yes. now.